P mitral is the wide and notched P wave of left atrial overload or left atrial abnormality typically seen in lead to in mitral stenosis. Normal P wave has a width of up to 2.5 mm or duration of 100 milliseconds. When the P wave widens, it is due to left atrial enlargement. The second component of normal P wave is contributed by left atrial activation. This activation spreads leftward from the sinus node through the backman's bundle and interatrial conduction pathway. The new terminology of left atrial abnormality for left atrial overload has been suggested because the same pattern can be seen in left atrial dilatation, left atrial hypertrophy or increased pressure in the left atrium or any combination of these. The terminology of left atrial abnormality was in use earlier also but less frequently. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Click on the subscribe button. Press the bell icon after that for all updates. Left atrial abnormality in the ECG has been used to predict left ventricular hypertrophy in the presence of right bundle branch block which may mask electrocardiographic evidence of left ventricular hypertrophy. In an echocardiographic study by Matha and Associates, 92% of those with left atrial abnormality had estimated left ventricular mass diagnostic of left ventricular hypertrophy. Six commonly used ECG criteria for left ventricular hypertrophy could detect only 5% of cases of left ventricular hypertrophy in the presence of right bundle branch block. Same group of authors have reported the utility of left atrial abnormality in the ECG for diagnosis of left ventricular hypertrophy in the presence of left bundle branch block as well. These are the initial set of references. Second set of references are here. Last two references are noted here. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for future updates and click on the bell icon for all updates. Thank you.